the rare chance if it's tameable this is going to be absolutely bonkers a bonk like insane creature oh he hits through the mound no no that is not cool What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved! That's right, we're playing here on the Dragon God server, having so much fun doing flips! Man, oh man! Guys, how you doing today? Are you doing good? I hope so, because I, I'm doing, personally, I'm doing pretty amazing. Yeah, because I remembered, I remembered last episode, we tamed up, yes, some amazing new creatures. We got, first and foremost, these insane looking wyverns. They got like leech heads, and um, yeah, they're called cave crawlers. We got two of them, one of them's the normal type, the other is a special super rare type called a red cave crawler. It's actually a different creature, believe it or not. They can't breed with each other or anything. It's got like different variations of stuff that it can do. But anyway, yeah, for the most part, this thing, it's, it's pretty silly looking, but look at this move. It can stretch its neck out like an accordion and actually pick up creatures and do torpor to them. Yeah, it's nuts, absolutely nuts. If you see one of these things, run. Run! We also got our very first hippocampus, I believe it is called. It's like a giant seahorse that you're able to ride. We got a shiny one, insane level. It's a lot of fun, yeah. But um, anyway, today, there's a lot of cool new stuff on the server. A lot has spawned in. So yeah, we got we got to get to work. We got to get to work. There's a bunch of interesting stuff that I want to check out. Interesting shinies um, and just overall creatures everything it's insane we gotta hurry before they despawn so wish me luck all right guys first up on the shiny finder it says there it ooh this guy's shiny too holy crud so it says there is a shiny sky tail that's the giant um glow tail lizards <laughs> look at this this is it so i thought something would be goofy with it because um it doesn't actually have, you know, there is no skeletal costume or anything anyone's made for a glow tail. So this is what it ends up looking like. Oh, poor little guy. There he is. Oh, had to get rid of him. Otherwise, it was kind of goofing up. But this is cool. Have we even got a razor tail? It's a jungle razor tooth, a 960 in level. It's actually pretty impressive. Um, oh, oh, oh. That's nuts. Um, can I can I start shoot you, bro? Let's get oh, let's get this guy knocked out. Let's do our dangdus. Can I net you, bro? Are you small? No. No, it's too big to net. I think. I don't know. Holy crap. All right. I don't think we've tamed one of these yet. But um, I like the look of this one being a jungle type. I think if we're gonna get one, this is the time. And what a phenomenal level. Come on, bro. You're spinning around me. He's kind of weird. What are you doing? <laughs> Holy crap. I don't know why his, his roars aren't affecting me. I mean, it's kind of like an... Uh... Oh, he can pick stuff up. I didn't know that. I did not know that. I'm kind of afraid. All right, good. You killed it. Do you see that? He like threw it up in the air and caught it in his mouth. That is kind of nuts. All right, he's starting to run, I think. I hope this is a knockout tame. Oh, dude, it's his passive tame. I'm just seeing this now. A sort of middle ground between Rex and Uteranus and Allosaur. Uh, while it falls to... Oh, man. How do you tame this? Dude, really? Just let me hit you, please. There we go. And he's down. All right. Maybe. Maybe we get lucky and it allows us to tame him. Nope, doesn't even let me in his inventory. That's the worst. Oh, I'm trying to read it really quick. That's really long. I don't want to read the whole thing. I'm going to have to look it up on the mod page. Whatever mod it's from, I don't know. Um, Let's put up a little uh, barrier around him just so he stays safe while I'm looking it up. But I'm going to have to figure out what mod this guy's from because I honestly don't know. All right, guys, first and foremost, I would like to check out the Wyvern Den. Yeah, because I've been wanting a Dodo Wyvern, and I saw there's some really good ones that are in here right now. And maybe we can find ourselves an eggs. 
you know, an egg for one of them. So let's just see. Uh, no eggs. I'm going to fly around the whole den and I'll just see. I'm not going to be too worried about these wyverns. Hopefully our guys should be able to hold up. Come on, baby. Give me something good. Give me something good. I'm kind of surprised. Not a single nest. All right. We got a nest that looks like it's probably a dota wyvern egg. All right. Let's smash all these guys. Come on. Let's -a go, bros. Let's -a go. Most of these are vanilla wyverns, so they're not like that scary. We are, you know, just on this dude. All right, that's fire wyvern. All right, what is this? This definitely, it's got to be a dota wyvern egg. That or it's like two eggs mixed together. What are you? 340. Not exactly as good as I wanted, but I'll take it. I'll take it and we'll run. Oh, super disappointing yet again. I have to say this is probably the third time that I've gone hunting for the uh, the Dota Wyvern eggs. I mean, yes, we found Dota Wyvern eggs, but I don't want like level 200 ones. Um, and every time I get a really high level like, nope, that's a small one. Oh, there is a 720 male that was in here and I thought I saw a female one, too, but yeah. No good. I've been killing them off, trying to get new ones to spawn in, but no luck with the eggs. In fact, I'm barely seeing any eggs. I ended up eating like every single one that I found that wasn't good, which was basically all of them. But eh, what you going to do? We'll try again another day. Let's carry on and uh, fire egg. Yeah, it looks like a fire egg. Let's carry on and see what else cool we could find. Man, Dota Wyvern would have been so cool, though. All right. Gotta wish me more luck, guys. This is the problem. You gotta wish me more luck. Wow. Look at this guy. Look at him. That is the Quetzal Draken. And yes, it is a boss, dude. It says it's not tameable, but I went and looked it up on the, uh, the mod page that it comes from. It, it's kind of weird. It claims that it does not spawn in naturally and it can only be brought in through admin commands. But these things have been spawned, so I don't know what's going on. Um, maybe the mod was just it was updated and then the mod author didn't update that it can spawn in naturally. I have no clue. I really don't know, but I didn't spawn this in and it's here. So that being said, on the page, it tells you, it doesn't say it's tameable, but it doesn't say it's not tameable, and it tells you what the commands are to be able to use it. So, which leads me to believe it can be tamed. I just don't know if it's only through admin commands that it can be tamed. We're not going to do that, but we're going to at least, just in case, because the spyglass has been known to be wrong, um... I think we need to at least try it out. Oh my goodness, you have so much stuff on you, bro, from the, the wyvern den. Holy crap. All right, let's grab all this stuff. All right, let me scoop you, bro. Let's just grab some meat. I meant to grab some meat. Where's where's your meat? All right, perfect. Let's grab out our cryo goddess. I, I believe the elder would probably be the preferred. So not frostbite. Let's go with, no, not chronos. It's Ice Princess. Let's go with Ice Princess and let's just see because it does have a boss bar, but this is from the same mod. I believe that the uh, the Grand Chimere was from and we were able to tame that guy had the same type of boss music. This is kind of cool. Oh, that's a shiny little skill or that little guy. Come here. Oh, OK. I did torpor to it. That's a positive. That is a huge positive. Let's see if we can drag this guy. I don't know where to drag him. I'll be honest with you. I don't know where's a good place to knock him out. Don't expect much. It doesn't have a taming food. So, I mean, that is not like a positive thing. Oh, look at the torpor. It's going up. It doesn't seem to fall down that quick. And I don't think much will attack this guy. I really don't know what it's based off of. Um, let's see if we can pull him all the way to that island over there. The rare chance, if it's tameable, this is going to be absolutely bonkers. A bonk, like, insane creature. Oh, he hits through the mound. No, no, that is not cool. All right. I don't, I'm not worried about my guy. We'll get him back, but... 
It's a good thing. I almost I almost put our, our leather wing on our shoulder. Almost. Like, it was really close to doing that. All right. Well, let me get all done up. I'll be right back. All right, guys. We're coming back in. And I, I just don't have a good feeling about this. Ooh, what is that? Uh, serrated wyvern. I don't know. It's also it's it's been losing torpor. Come on, bro. I don't think we're gonna be able to knock it out too. Is the other issue at this point? It looked like it was really close before. Oh, we gotta watch out because remember this guy can. Oh, we didn't. We did torpor there without doing much damage. Oh, this is so close. Oh, this is like the worst spot to knock you out, bro. Seriously, this is not a good area. No, I, I don't want it to kill me again. All right, let's just see what happens. Because it doesn't have a food that it eats. It's probably just a boss. Oh, oh, oh. All right. It looks like it's unconscious. Let's just see if we can get in the inventory. Oh, it is so enormous. Oh. Let's just see what happens. Can I get... Oh. Weird. Oh, so it's definitely unconscious. Come on. Okay, I can go in the inventory. Let's just throw everything we got in it. It lets me do that. Oh, put food in to tame. Um, oh, won't let me starve it like that. Crap. Oh, there's some bad stuff here. I don't see eating anything. Um, If it can be tamed, it's either a different food or something. Oh, crap. Let's let's clear out the area. Come on, dude. Um, come here, Ice Princess. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, this guy's so cool. Oh, that's a modded guy. I thought that was a shiny. What is up with this guy? I don't know. Yeah, see, it doesn't have a name. All right, let's just let that guy chill for a bit. If we can't... Oh, I don't want... No, 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 no. Serrated Wyvern. Serrated Wyvern, come, come to me. Come to me. Stupid serrated wyvern. Don't... I'm going to be even more mad if it messes up the tame. All right. Hopefully it didn't hit that guy. It's weird when you hit the serrated wyverns that it does that. Ah, it says put food in inventory to tame, but what food? What does a crackle... Dra a quetzal draken eat? Like, honestly. I mean, I'm pretty sure I had normal meat in there, too. You know what? Let's just do this and this. We get maybe like a crappy tame, but it would at least be something. It just, it doesn't tell you a food. So I don't know. Maybe, maybe we'll end up having one. Let's put in some of that. Let's put in like some of that, some of that. Cause we got to wait for it to actually get hungry to eat. It's bound to be something. Starve. Doesn't work. I don't know. We'll see. Worst case scenario, we lose that stuff. I'm not going to cry over that. All right. So if we can actually get off of this guy, maybe we get a tamed one. Maybe we don't get a tamed one. Oh, but I'm not going to wait up on it. So on that note, on that note, since we have the obsidian dude right here, why don't we check this guy out? Oh, what do we hit for? What's our raw hits? 21. Okay, I think we can do this. What's it fighting with? It's fighting with that guy, but that guy's like doesn't even notice. Oh, look at this crab. How much? Okay. Oh, that's not good. Dragon God right there. All right. Ooh, it's going to be a double hitter. Come on, come on. Oh, we got this. This is go definitely going to be a thing. I... Oh, whoa. That was scary. All right. So this guy likes Extraordinary Kibble. You know, I'm, I'm not going to complain. This is kind of cool. So Extraordinary Kibble, it was, what, four? Or was it five? I don't know. Let's just put in five. Whatever. It was four. I'll take one out. All right. Oh, no, 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 no. Crap. 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 It said, I think it said it was bad efficiency. No. No. <laughs> this is just not my day. It is not my day. Why? 
but we still got it. It is still epic and amazing. Oh, but we overhit him, I think. That is nuts. All right, at least we got something. I am I am very pleased with that. And this thing is beautiful. Absolutely stunning. Yeah, it is really cool looking. All right, um, I'm going to hang out here and just see what happens with this dude. I'm going to try and do a little bit more research. I really have the strong impression that it's not tameable, though. Like, I think you have to cheat tame it if you want it, and I'm not going to do that. So we'll be right back. All right, guys, not looking good. Uh, I let it starve out quite a bit. I'm pretty sure it would have taken a bite if it was even possible. Like, there's nothing that says it can't be tamed except for the spyglass, but it doesn't say how to tame it. And I feel like it would have taken a bite if it could have. And it's got so many different foods, unless it tames off with some weird food. So you know what? I don't want to waste all my kibbles and everything. Let's just leave it as is like this. And I don't know. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Alpha Megalodon. Come here, bro. Let me see if I can just eat this guy. Get wrecked. Awesome. It's my first Alpha Megalodon fins. All right. Um, We did get a Grand Obsidian Wyvern. We kind of messed it up. It got overhit. Let me see if there's another one of those on the server. There's usually more than one. And I think that would be pretty epic. I, we got to get something epic today after so many fails. All right, guys, absolutely zero, zero luck today. Um, I could not find another Obsidian Wyvern. Um, maybe there's one out there, but I could not find it. I did see, holy crap. I did see this. You can tell it's a shiny. You probably don't know what it is. It's that vampire dude. Remember we got, oh, no, 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 no. You stay away from my vampire, dude. All right. Good Lord. I've been defending this thing forever. And it is getting whooped left and right by like all these crazy, stupid creatures that are able. Yeah, all these guys, these annoying things. I've been picking them up or at least trying to pick them up and kill them um, before they like everything. The herbivores, everybody, everybody goes ham against this vampire dude i just want to tame him it's a spectral spectrals are kind of rare and that's a really fun creature i really like him so uh let's let's just see what we can do no 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 you come back over here bro um i think we tried to net this guy in the past and it didn't work um i should be able to get him myself holy crap um <laughs> it kind of hurts Holy crap. Uh, let's let's just see. What does the net thing say? No, no. Oh, that hurts. What does the net thing say? I said uh, it says no. It says no go. Just in case. Just in case. You always want to try it. Just in case. All right. Come on. Come on. Come on quick. Oh, almost dead. Holy crap. He is getting me badly. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Quick. 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 Oh, uh, uh dude all right it's out thank goodness um everything aggro's against this guy it's so annoying oh this was the blood packs one. Oh, so annoying i i vaguely remember this all right um unfortunately i'm gonna have to teleport back oh you know what oh no it took a crap ton of blood packs as i recall like a crap ton of them Urgh. Um, we probably maybe we don't starve this guy out. I do have on me though from the last time we did this my blood packs, and I could go like this and rotate between them, and hopefully we can get all the blood packs that we need. This just isn't our day, guys. It is not our day. Um, I think we tamed another one of these, and it was a much lower level one. So this one's an 840. Um, I want to demonstrate something for you. So it, it's at least off of blood packs and it also i went and read the steam page it claims so you can see the spyglass it let me move my chair it says blood packs then ammonite and then leech blood um are the food so i'm about to try one of those but i just want to demonstrate check this out so if i go to a thousand times speed all right so you get to see it like what it does at a fast pace and then i go to taming list it eats and then it can't eat because the blood pack, you know, and I starved it out.
the blood pack, uh, it won't allow you to eat for uh, like what, like however many seconds. So that's what's happening. And in the time that it can't eat anything, because it's it's got the cooldown on the blood packs, the taming goes back down. And um, I, it's also lost taming efficiency because of this. <sighs> oh, and by the way, look at our, our uh, other guy. Oh, no, that's that's another guy that got I'm not sure when he got knocked out. This dude, he's going to die. <laughs> All right. Anyway, um, I also tried it at night and it's doesn't work at night either. So let's go back to the base. Throw that in there. Let's throw. Where's my leech blood? It's probably in here. Let's just see what happens if it doesn't drop after it eats. And maybe we'll put the leech blood first. Let's see what happens. It says put food in inventory. So it goes up to 15, but then immediately it does the blood pack shenanigans. All right. So let's just take the blood packs out and see what happens. It still says put food in inventory to tame. Let's speed up time just to see if it will even attempt to eat it. And it won't even. Come on. I think it's just too high of a level. It, it's got to be. It's got to be that. It's got to be that it's too high of a level. So frustrating. What you going to do? It would have been cool. Yet another tame that would have been cool. All right. Let's carry on. I'll, you know what? I feel bad for you. I'll, I'm just going to leave you there. Whatever. I don't feel very bad for you, actually. At all. At all. Oh. All right. Moving on. Oh, my goodness. Um. So, yeah, this thing's going to probably die. It's probably going to die, but um, it's really cool. Oh, so it's getting whooped by stuff. <sighs> How this thing works, it, it's it's an interesting mechanic, but du this dude is like so weak. And these guys are, I think, all from the same mod as it, and they are whooping his butt. This is a Chimera, and it's a 760, and it's supposed to basically kill something. And after it kills something, it gets a buff to, or it gets like, it enters a, a stage where you can then walk up and passive tame it, but only when it's in that stage of having killed something. But I mean, come on now. That was a bunch of herbivores. It just whooped its butt. I don't even want that thing, but it's just one of those days, guys. Like, honestly, what is going on? I think I found something. Finally, I think, I think, yes, look at that, Pangolin Wyvern, um, I've been wanting one of these for a while, um, it is a KO tame, and uh, we're probably gonna have to do it by hand, um, probably gonna have to do it by hand, but that's okay, that's okay, I don't mind, let's just get all these little turds out of the way, come on, leave here, go away, this is way too strong of a creature to be able to go after him um all right just finish go away let's just clear out the area oh, what is that i see a boss bar i don't know what that is oh micro raptor's not good oh there's so much badness here all right whatever it can keep fighting with that thing let's see if we can get some torpor up on it oh what is that Oh, uh, it's some type of boss. I don't know. Oh my goodness, really? That's the worst time. Why do you why do you have to go hungry right at the worst time? Oh crap. Oh crap. That does bone break. Alright, I hope he killed that other thing. Oh, that's nasty. Alright, alright. Just if he's not focused on me. Oh, I got another bone break. Is that from this dude or what's going on? <laughs> My dragon does not like this. It's this like, I do not appreciate this D-Mac. This guy resists like crazy. All right. I don't see him taking any hits from anything. Unless like, imagine if he hit himself right then. All right. Uh... It's probably, you know, how today's been going. 100%. Oh, I want this so bad. Five, five. Kibble. Five. Start, please be one of the ones to start about. Thank you, game. Thank you. 
All right, let's get ready to pick him up immediately. It, it, like, seriously, it's one of those days. I cannot trust anything. Finally! We got a perfect tame of something. Holy! Let's get the crap out of here and let's try out our new guy. All right, guys, we finally, we finally pulled it off and got a tame that was not damaged or messed up or something. Oh, what a day today has been. Yes, we got an Obsidian Wyvern. It is epically cool and awesome, but I feel like it wouldn't do it justice if I actually tried it out today. I want to wait. There was none on the server. I checked. I checked before we went to do the pangolin. Um... I think we're going to wait to actually try it out until I can get like a really good one that's not messed up in the uh, the taming results. So, yeah, um, I did 100% confirm and finally got through to the mod author. The Quetzal Draken is, in fact, in, without admin commands, is not tameable. So kind of a shame, but hey, we tried. We tried, you know, but this guy, holy crud, I've been eyeing these for a while, and I've been wanting them. They are so incredibly cool. Heavily armored, heavily armored um, wyvern. It's actually most closely related to the dodo wyvern. As you can see, it actually has a dodo wyvern face, kind of. Um, but this thing, it's kind of funny. It hates, when I say hate, it hates other wyverns. Like, to the point where in the lore, it actually goes and seeks out other wyverns to crush their eggs. Yeah, it is mean. It is a super mean creature. Tons of resistance and, um, yeah, very aggressive. So, um, the deal with this guy, it's got left click bite. Okay, cool look. I like it. Right click, wing slap. I love when creatures do this. All wyverns need this. I... It's unfortunate. Now, um, it seems like that does have a decent sized. I'm, I'm spamming my right click. It takes a while to do it again. Yep, there we go. So a, a big cooldown. Um, C with claws. Okay, that must be his, his like under claws on his, his lower feet. That's why it looked kind of goofy. And then let's see. Devour deals 20 damage and gains health regeneration upon eating a corpse. Okay, not the coolest animation, but I like that little effect. But yeah, health regeneration. And then, of course, come on, do a good roar. All right, all right. Kind of. The noise, though, it's it's the noise of what, when wyverns, like, poop or eat or something like that. <laughs> Either way, this thing looks sick. It looks like an armored dodo rex. Um, all right, so let's see what it actually, actually is going to hit for and everything like that. Come here. I love the way it runs, though. It, um... A lot of the wyverns in this pack do this, and I think that is so cool. Like it's it's a little bit different. It doesn't use its arms when it when it kind of goes around, but it, it's an interesting look. All right, this guy's probably mate boosted, but all right. Oh, now one thing I noticed, it attacks really fast. So that's the first guy. Obviously, was um, mate boosted. So 890s not. Oh, wow. So 900 now. Okay, that's not bad. That's a very respectable amount. All right, what was the devour again? It was left control. So this, if we needed health, I need the corpse like that. Oh, weird. Weird, how'd I? So now it's gonna see, show all the other stuff that health regener, it doesn't say anything about this that I noticed anyway. That's kind of interesting, unless that has to do with him being some type of shiny thing. I don't know. Get smashed! That didn't do that much damage. I don't know why it costs so much. That's weird. And it also doesn't have an axe. So that's kind of weird. All right, he's doing way less damage to this guy. I'm noticing. Is that because of this guy's bug boost? Oh, this guy's actually putting a heart on us. Good lord. What is up with that? Do you see that? Our health is way down, and this guy's resisting the crap out of us. Oh my goodness. All right, let's heal up anyway. Um, I don't know what happened there. I have no idea. Nothing in there unless I'm reading the wrong guy. Yeah, it hits for good damage, but it attacks quick. All right, this claw thing I think is supposed to be done while it's flying. Oh, no, weird. You can't do it when you're flying. That is super bizarre. All right, so then what, what does this do? Let me Let me get you then. Claw inflicts gashed buff damage, uh, debuff, 
has a slight cooldown, hits multiple times. What the crap's going on with this guy? Oh, there we go. Okay, so it's like he, he goes back and then he goes forward and does damage. All right, fair enough, fair enough. I'm doing now just the... Oh, okay, so when he harvests the body, you get that effect. That is weird. That's super weird, but I like it. Yeah, look, even the Parasaur hits us. All right, and this guy can obviously fly. What do the other stats look like? All right, that's why we went down in health so quick. It only got 17,000 health, which isn't, like, huge, but it's not nothing. All in all, it's, it's reasonable stats. I like it. I wish it had a saddle, though. I wish more things in this mod had a saddle. But anyway, um... Let me get some actual levels into this guy. Um, we don't have a ton of time, so let's just get it all the way to the top and check it out. All right, guys, we are there already. It actually did not take long at all. Not at all. Um, I was going around the this area, you know, the big boys and uh, killing a couple mirrors gets us there pretty quick. Now, I've already boosted him to 100,000 health and it was probably within like five to ten boosts. So it's pretty good. Um, this is one of the few wyverns that is able to level speed in this mod. So I got to take that into consideration um, if that's something I want. Now, also, this guy, it says it can fly backwards, but <laughs> I'm not seeing it fly back. Am I looking at the right stinking thing? It, it doesn't seem to fly backwards for me, so I'm not entirely sure what it's talking about. Can I... I don't know what it's talking about. That is so weird. Does it say how it flies backwards? I have no I have no clue. But yeah, we're able to rip through even golems and stuff like that that a lot of the lesser guys couldn't. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, of course, that's from a different mod. Um, Let's say, come on, let me out of here. I hate taking on these golems because I get stuck inside of them. It's really annoying. Oh, dude, are you kidding me? You gonna do this to me? All right, let's do the whole little dismount trick, maybe. Will, will that get you out? What? What? Huh? Now I can't even get in your inventory? Come here. Follow, follow me. Follow me. Come on. There's badness here. I need I needs you. I need your assistance. Crap. This is not good. Uh, let me up. Let me up. Ah, he's like, oh, you want to strand me there? <laughs> oh, you stupid thing. All right, let's not go play around with those guys. Uh, Elder Blackheart, that's still above our pay grade. Um, so other things I was noticing, Harry Waits in that questionable area where it's good enough, but it could use a little more. Um, let me see. I don't want to mess with those guys. Not because they're too hard. I just don't want to get stuck in them again. Um, I'm I didn't think it needed movement speed, but... Now I'm kind of feeling like we're already at 100,000 health. Um, it's never going to be one of our biggest hitters. Let's just see. Oh, are you kidding me? It only gets one. All right, whatever. Let's go all out. I think it'll be fun. Um, yeah, let's go all out. All right, 129. We got into it. And it's, it's noticeably faster, but it is no speed demon. I'll tell you that much. But, um... Some other features of this guy that I really liked is that 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 arm slash, he can do it while flying. I don't know. To me, I wish there wasn't a cooldown. It is one of the most satisfying moves. <laughs> he just smacks him. And I don't get why there's a big cooldown for it, but cuz the other move, let's see. 18,000 versus Come here, bro. Maybe it's just got a bigger radius, 18,000. So it does about the same. Um Maybe it's because it inflicts the gash damage. I don't know. No clue why why it would have been not uh, do that. But it's just so much fun. It is just so much fun. Now, the whole health drain thing, um, you can actually use it to do damage. And then it just heals up like an RG, supposedly. Maybe I got to do it twice. There we go. On the actual dead body. So kind of helpful. It's kind of weird how it, it does this. I guess it's neat. Let's see what it looks like without the spyglass. So you can kind of see things better. It's interesting. It's interesting. But all in all, I think it is a beautiful creature. And I'd say it's pretty like middle of the road for once you start to get to like, you know, wyvern level stuff. But I think it's fun. Come here, bro. Awesome. And I've wanted one so bad. I'm so happy to have a shiny one. Boom. Oh, what are you, cock? 
<laughs> you see that guy just booking towards us? It's nuts. It would have been neat if it had a couple of other effects against wyverns. There is this particular thing that it says when dread wyverns are near, it will receive a rivalry buff. So that's kind of cool. But um, it's annoying about this fly backwards thing. Unless there's a button I got to press, but I'm not seeing it. And when I fly backwards, it does not fly backwards. So hopefully that gets fixed or I get told how to actually do it. Oh, it just has such a nice profile, though. And that little horn on the nose, I think, is really cool. What is that, from the dung beetle? I don't know. Something has it. But anyway, I love our new creature. Let's go head on back to the base, and I do think it is that time. All right, guys. I think it's now that time. That's right. Time to name the dinos! For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go through the comments of the previous episode and I pick out all the most awesomest name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there. That's right. If you want to have a chance at getting your name chosen, all you got to do is you got to be a subscriber. So smash that subscribe button and yeah, just comment down there. It is just that easy. Anyway, for today, we have that giant seahorse um, to name. That guy, unfortunately, I don't have him out because, yeah, there's no water right here. That name I'm going with is none other than Kingdra. Yeah, Pokemon reference. Pretty cool. For the cavern crawlers, we have none other than... Boom! I'm going to probably murder these names, but Kezu and... Gizmo, yeah, and people are saying um, these guys look very similar to yet another creature from the Monster Hunters. I have a feeling the mod author is a big Monster Hunter fan, but of course that's cool. It's cool to be able to have these awesome creatures. Unfortunately, I don't know Monster Hunters, <laughs> so to me, I don't know, but um, yeah, I think it's pretty awesome. I like it, and I think they're really cool creatures. For next episode, we, of course, we're still going to name. We need a name for the Obsidian Wyvern. Yes. And for our Pangolin Wyvern, this bad boy over here. So I cannot wait to find out what they're going to be. Anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. It's been a pleasure. As always, please remember to show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. Seriously, it really does help me out. And... If you haven't yet or you're new to the channel, please do not forget to subscribe for the Daily Arc Awesomeness. And as always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. If you haven't yet, don't forget to join the Discord. Yep. And I'll be streaming in roughly four to five hours from now over on Twitch. So come check me out. Anyway, till then, thanks for watching. As always, peace out.